program in the Ubuntu Linux phone mod running on the Samsung S4 GT i9505 that's what it is so you just saw the phone booting up it has a little daring uh, Linux uh, uh, penguin and it looks all nice and I think it really looks nice this is the lock screen that you're looking at uh, if you have your notifications on then you will find them in here um, and we can log in by tapping on the circle and the passcode for this phone is 4 times 0 what you see here is uh, in fact what I um, kinda saw as well in the library I was looking for a launcher that was you know that would have this effect and not the side left and right uh, slide effect okay because that's as well what I saw in the Librem 5 uh, the Librem 5 is a phone uh, the guys uh, are now having a crowdfunding uh, for this uh, project and if everything goes good in January uh, 2019 um, they want to bring a phone that will run on Linux uh, on the market and it will be sold for 599 uh, dollars but with this rom i kind of wanted to create uh, a mod a rom i can also make a rom uh, for certain phones uh, that will have this after you installed it and here at the side you see the bar and uh, you can also put it at the left side but i think if you have it on the right side uh, most of the times you have your phone in your left hand then you know it's easier to scroll uh, with your thumb uh, if the launcher is at at least the the dock is at the right side but if you're left left-handed then you can put the dock at the left side so you can then use your left thumb to um, to scroll so that's kind of cool because in here in the settings you will find all sorts of little thingies that you can change around screen edge here this was what i was saying you can put it at the left and now in fact it's for left-handed people you know with their thumb they can then you know or yeah if you're having the phone in your left hand and you're using the phone with one hand then probably it's also uh, uh, good uh, to use uh, or to have the the dock at the at the left side but i personally i love it um, i love it at the right side because i find uh, it easier to use because i'm holding the phone in my left hand and with my right hand i'm 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 doing the scrolling and 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 whatever so that's kind of cool this is for left and right handed people right so no discrimination here um, the mod that I created for this phone also has eye launcher of course because if you hit the eye launcher and the other uh, look and feels are a little bit too much for you then you can also go to the simple look and feels and here you will find uh, the eye launcher but then uh, with uh, all the all the Linux icons uh, in fact I, 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 I put them in like one by one here this is a themed uh, uh, eye launcher with uh, icons that come from Linux Mint 18 uh, from out the Y team okay the Y team it's it's having beautiful icons and I I felt in love immediately with these icons when I saw them the first time so I made a mix of iOS and uh, and Linux icons in this in this model thing that you're seeing here um, so all the icons that you see here for instance the Linux phone icon um, etc they are all the, the icon disappeared okay it started again there you go all right so there it is so all these icons that you see here uh, just for the clock and the settings these are from ios uh, are from linux okay and here you can see it as well the browser the green uh, safari icon 
uh, the Firefox icon, the orange one, the files, F files, file uh, folder, iNote icon, the email icon, the recorder icon, the One Mobile Market icon, the Audio FX icon. You see that? Uh, these are all, um, um, in fact, the Facebook icon here, the Facebook Lite icon, the Scan Radio icon. These are all uh, icons from uh, Linux Mint that I used just to give it this Linux feeling. Also the phone icon, the messaging icon, and even the Firefox icon that you see here at the bottom. Okay, they all come from Linux. So yeah, the phone will have uh, two launchers, but the two launchers will not be immediately installed. Um, the phone will come as, as the Linux phone, uh, like this. Wait, hold on, let me get back to the launcher. I'm still here. Let me go to my Ubuntu launcher. There we are. You see? So uh, after you install the ROM, it will look like this. And then uh, you will have to go ahead and um, enable root access. I just said when you install the ROM, but I'm, I, I mean the mod. When you flash the mod on top of, for instance, this, any Linux OS that runs on your phone, then you're going to enable the developer's option options and then you go back and then above about the phone you can uh, turn on advanced restart in the developers option and you can scroll down and up here you should give the apps root access okay so now you're done now you can turn on your firewall and now everything will will be working for you as you can see my firewall is enabled um, I have um, let me see my root browser of course my root browser is having root access so I can I can get into my system and um, for you important to know is after you gained root access then you're gonna go to system and here at the bottom you will find the iOS 2 launcher you're gonna find icons the icons you will have to copy to your SD card the one here um, SD card here because this one corresponds directly with your phone you can copy it into your into your pictures okay don't move but copy okay so you go to system for instance this is the icon folder long press and then you say copy okay and then you go uh, one home you go to SD card and then you paste the icons uh, for instance oh, in uh, in your pictures yeah just paste them in there okay and then you're gonna reboot your phone and after the reboot you will be able to see all the icons <coughs> and then one by one you can go ahead and change your uh, icons around for the time being because um, I'm seriously working on uh, uh, on on Linux uh, or at least apps with Linux icons so I have a bunch of apps that I will have to uh, kind of convert and give them beautiful Linux icons at least the ones that I think that are beautiful and then uh, whenever you're gonna install that app it will show that icon uh, so I won't have to you know uh, go ahead and do all the icons one by one and then immediately you will have these look and feels in the icon and then in fact uh, this Ubuntu uh, um, home screen will look even better because it will then show only Linux Mint uh, Y team icons or any any uh, PNG icon that you want to use and, and love so you don't have to go for my look and feels uh, go into Linux uh, your favorite distribution with beautiful icons and go find the icons and uh, go building you know copy these PNGs to your to your phone get the right size by the way you need uh, different sizes for different screens just look uh, which one fits the best and then uh, go ahead and uh, 
pimp your phone and make it beautiful and make it uh, world's only phone that you know have these look and feels so that's it uh, i don't want to make this video any longer so uh, as soon as this rom is done uh, i'm gonna put down a download link for you then you can download it and install it on the s4 well in fact uh, it's gonna be a mod and you will be able to flash that mod uh, i think into every rooted android phone that has a custom recovery like uh, clockwork mod or or twerp uh, should be able to flash this mod and of course you're doing this at your own risk and you uh, must know how to fix your phone back uh, if it goes wrong if the if some apps were not accepted if you get uh, a sim link or a, a s power parse error uh, problem you know then i cannot help it then it has to do with your phone so you must first uh, see if all the apps uh, kind of work but uh, the apps that i'm using um, i have success on many phones uh, running them so i don't think it would be any problem so yeah until then i want to thank you for watching if you think this video was cool leave it a thumbs up of course subscribe to my channel uh, hit the little notification uh, thing the bell so you will be uh, updated whenever i post a new video thanks for watching again and uh, until my next video bye bye